Hi guys, um, my name is Kaylee. If you don't remember me from any of my other videos, I'm a teacher at Arise. Guest appearance today would be my dogs. They're very needy and they follow me wherever I go. <laughs> Stop. Um, so, he wants me to pet him. Can you see? Okay, so um, today we are going to go over how to use Zoom off our phone. And I'm also going to make a video on how to use Zoom off of your computer. So this took me a little while because I was also trying to figure out how to use Zoom off my phone. And um, once I figured it out, it was super simple. All you really have to do is download this app. So I'm going to go through the process of getting the app, um, going to your email and getting your request, and then um, opening up and being part of a Zoom meeting. Okay, so here we go. Here I am, I'm gonna click this app right here. And it's gonna take me a little second, but I'm gonna show you where to go. This button down here is what you would um, go to <laughs> to be, look, I'm sorry, search for the app, okay. So once I do that, I click that button and I type up here Zoom. So when I type in Zoom, it's going to be the first one you see. Okay? Mine says open because I already have it on my computer, but yours will say get if you don't have it on your computer yet. Now you have to do is press that get and then um, get into your and download it on your computer. So I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like so you don't get the wrong one. Uh, here it is. There you go. And I'm gonna press open, but I mean, I would press get if I was getting it. Now I got it, okay? Now it should be on your computer. It might not be on a certain, you might have to like look around on your phone for it. Um, but, so your email, your teacher sent you an email to get onto Zoom at four o'clock for a meeting. So you're gonna get an email with that request or maybe a text message. I'm not sure what your teachers are doing with that. But um, most most times you'll get an email from your teacher with the request. So here, or your teacher can text it to you. Jocelyn was nice enough to send me a Zoom request. So I'm gonna open up Jocelyn's email and it's gonna tell me the details. So this is April 8th at 2 p.m. My meeting will start and I'm going to join the meeting. Obviously you wouldn't join the meeting until that two o'clock time or that four o'clock time, but it's good to have the request um, or know when, it, when it's going to be. So important things maybe to look at is your meeting ID and your password. When you have the app, you can go on and find a meeting just by typing in the meeting ID and the password. Okay, but if you're, you can also just click this and it'll bring you right to your app. So instead of like fudging around with uh, Google or Safari, um, this will bring you straight to the app. I'm gonna click this and it opened up my Zoom app for me. So now my Zoom app just opened up automatically. Um, you, you might wanna sign up for Zoom. I mean, it's not terribly important because you can still get into meetings without signing up in, with Zoom, but um, if you do sign up with Zoom, then you can just type in the meeting ID when it comes that time too. Um, and then what I do is I press join meeting. So here I go, I'm gonna press join meeting, and then I'm gonna name myself something. So instead of iPhone, I'm just gonna put my name Kaylee H, and I'm gonna press continue. And this would help um, so that your teachers know who you are when you enter the Zoom meeting, and you're, you might not, you don't have to let Zoom send you notifications, but if you set up all your meetings on Zoom and it will notify you when your Zoom meeting is about to start so you're not late for it. So I put allow and then access your microphone. You obviously want them to hear you. And then some important icons to look at. Um, your audio is joined. Your video is not yet. And, um, hey, stop it. Stop it. And this is how many people are in it. So what I do is I click start video. And I press yes to this too. And I press start video. And then my icon or what it looks like is going to 
couldn't say yes. Um, and then my video started. So there we are. Perfect. And then to leave the meeting, all I pressed was leave meeting. All right. Um, and that is how we use Zoom on our phones. Super simple. Um, once you do it once or twice, so you'll get the hang of it. Um, so if you have any other questions, make sure you tell your teachers your questions so that I can make a video on it.